I don't care that someone does every single live stream about us. Because if we leave the app, which they want us to do, um, they wouldn't have nothing to talk about, will they? Jane, if you leave the app, our work is done, and all of us can get back to our original content. Until then, we will keep working at this. They won't be able to do Groundhog Day. Fucking Groundhog Day. How many times are you going to repeat the same fucking meaningless phrase? No one has watched the film, and no one fucking cares about your pathetic attempt to slate us. Using this strange term, it just makes you look stupid. No. So, one, one, I think it's disgusting that you have my dead mum's picture on YouTube. No, Jane. What's disgusting is you lying about your mum's death for years by telling everyone she had taken her own life. When she passed away from natural causes, your mum would be ashamed. Have you, Jane? Us exposing your lies is just something you're going to have to accept as a consequence. My dead father-in-law's video on YouTube. You posted a video, Vedgar, to your own Facebook page, Jane. You fucking dweeb, don't you dare blame anyone else when you posted it yourself to a public platform. And other bits of my family on YouTube. Once again, another lie. Have you not learnt a fucking lesson yet from all these lies, Jane? You are so fucking thick. Um, that actually hurts to see my mum on YouTube. Your desperate need to be a victim is starting to become tedious, Jane. Not one person cares about what hurts you anymore, you evil fucking scumbag. Take some fucking responsibility for your own actions. And also that you have men in white suits. Because my mum had forensics in the house. Forensics do not attend to an individual who has passed away. Naturally from heart problems, Jane. Walking horrible thing to lie about. The trauma you claim to have. From this is non-existent. Just like the men in fucking white suits. Jesus fucking Christ. And that vision of them brings it back to me. Brings what back, Jane, the memories from when you made it all up. Good fucking Lord above. So, yeah, I think you're fucking sick. The feeling is fucking mutual. It's my mum. It's not fucking yours. Your mum didn't deserve what you've done. She would be turning in her fucking grave. I love my mum dearly. Then why did you tell such a horrific lie you really are? Fucking dent. Me and Peter was at my mum's every single day before she passed. We very rarely miss the day. Very rarely. Does she give anyone else killer nurse Beverly a lit vibe? You are the one that's disgusting. Not me. I beg to fucking differ. You keep pushing me, Jane. And my patience is wearing thin. Try me.